what's up everybody and welcome to flicking on my big tarot it's your girl miss dc and i am back again you guys super excited and again i am an aquarius so i figure why not do a love reading this time for my fellow aquas okay also please remember that this is not every single individual story and uh, cross watchers you're more than welcome to take and utilize the information for the highest most positive intent also you guys make sure to like share subscribe and if this is so leave me a comment and let me know i'm going to be using three decks this time instead of the two one i'm going to be using the moonology oracle card deck and then the light shares tarot deck and then the doreen virtue love um romance angels deck okay so yes y'all super excited to get into this like i don't and i like to keep my stuff inside of the box because i'm just one of those people i don't like to uh-uh I like my stuff to be in order. So I'm gonna pull three oracle cards. What do my Aquarius need to know and love? Oh, don't look y'all. What do my Aquarius need to know and love? A personal issue reaches a solution, okay? So, you might be getting ready to figure out something about a situation. You may be on the verge of figuring out, figuring it out. You probably haven't thought about it yet. Like, you literally haven't thought about it. So, we have expect powerful change. So, whatever resolution you come to, might create some type of powerful change whether it be a mental change whether it be a physical change um you know could be a number of things prosperity lies ahead so there's so much good moving forward in whatever current situation you're going through okay beautiful start so i'm gonna pull one of the romance angel cards just to get a general idea of um what your love life is going to be looking like potentially or what you just may need to do right now you know and these are the cards and i really like these cards because they have i don't know if you can oh yeah they have gold on the side oh and i absolutely love them absolutely love them and they're pink and like gold and so reconciliation someone from your past is returning to your life you know what i actually do the tarot myself as in i listen to it you know i really do i listen to it and that has been coming out a lot here lately reconciliation I don't know what is going on right now. Birth is like hitting my mind for anybody who it's just, I guess, COVID got everybody out here just wanting an implant, you know, and um, I got a host, you know, I feel some type of way about that, but we're going to go ahead and get into your turret. <laughs> um, yeah, but personal issues reach a resolution, expect powerful change, prosperity lives ahead, and you may be running into some rest reconciliation with a partner. Right now, you're very indecisive. You feel stuck. And you're coming out of it. Maybe um, it says personal issues reach a resolution. So you're probably trying to make a decision. I told you, you're probably getting ready to come up with a decision if you didn't yet. But you might feel stuck about it. But you're coming out of it. That's why prosperity lies ahead because you come out of it and that means that's a prosperous situation because you, you know, you got through it. You you prospered. 
you know. Right now, you're probably thinking about your pinnacles. And you don't really care about being judged. But you are isolating yourself, maybe. You know, giving yourself time to think. You know, not really caring what people think because it's all about your money or it's all about the things that are, you know, at this point, important to you, virtue wise or, you know, stability wise. Pentacles is a card of stability. So right now it's just like, you know what? The relationship is really not even on my mind. Maybe it is. Maybe that's what I feel like I'm indecisive about. Maybe being in a relationship. And I'm just kind of in hermit mode. Like, I'm literally just going places by myself, you know, getting something to eat by myself, going to the mall. If if I go, go walking, whatever, I do it by myself. You know what I'm saying? I come home, go to sleep by myself, wake up by myself, take a shower by myself, all of that good stuff. You know, meditate by myself, take care of my kids by myself. It's a bunch of shit that's going on. You know what I'm saying? So, yes, we got to make sure we're protecting our energy and you, it's like i if i do i do if i don't i don't but in doing this you're not fulfilling your heart's desire but you need to think about it like you need to think about it okay so cards that we have right now two of swords the hangman and the Five of Swords in reverse. We also have the Ace of Pentacles. The Judgment in reverse. The Hermit. Page of Wands. Ace of Cups. And Four of Cups reversed. So, like, you're just, like, really on your head about it. About making a decision on it. You know, should I be in a relationship? Should I not? But whatever it is, you feel like it's not going to bring you your heart's desire and you're really just like, whatever, you know. And it sucks. You know, like I said, a lot of us, I feel like, are going through that right now. And as unfortunate as it is, prosperity lies ahead. We don't even realize that, you know, we go through the process. We just find ways of, of getting there. And sometimes relationships do get in the way of the things that we really need to do. And so when you go through, I feel like, a pattern of fucked up relationships, it might just be a sign that right now is just not the time for it. You know what I'm saying? Because it's just not working out. So get out of that hermit mode. Make a decision that best suits you. Deal with it. Don't deal with it. But expect change. Get out of being stuck. You know, I really didn't even have to pull one, but reconciliation, you know what I mean, right now. Um, and it says, rec reconciliation, ooh, I dropped my box. <laughs> okay. Someone from your past is returning to your life. Now, the thing is, a lot of time when we see this, we automatically subconsciously assume that it's like getting ready to happen like now but sometimes this could take you know 37 days it might even take 82 days you know what it might take 147 days okay 147 you're in the right place it might take that many days it may take a couple of months you know what i'm saying it might even take a year but you're going to go through the process i just looked at my screen excuse my screen because yes i've been touching it and I got a messed up nail. So, <laughs> but yes, y'all pay attention to the signs when it comes to you being in a relationship right now. But it's coming. You know what I mean? It's coming. So, yeah, you guys, this is pretty much aqua your your situation. You're just probably right now just like not really too focused on a relationship. If you are in a relationship, you might be thinking about getting out of it. You know, you might be thinking about getting out of it and just just chilling and doing you. Or if you're single, you might be dating or whatever, but or trying to make a decision on whether you want to or not, whether you really, really want to be with whoever this individual is. Maybe if not, you know, but a lot of y'all I see just kind of like, you know what? I just went through some shit. I'm trying to chill. OK, so, yes, uh, Aquas, this is y'all's love reading and i'm just happy i'm happy with this like i said i'm a fellow aquarius and yeah no bias but i feel it like energies attract that way you know what i'm saying so reach a solution 
and don't be too too much in your head about it like it is what it is it's gonna happen anyway so yes please think about it stay spiritual and i will see you guys next time <gasps> looking on my big tarot out